So the second lesson in the cognitive explanations, we're looking at cognitive reappraisals. Um, okay, so we'll look at how and why reappraisals influence stress. And this is a slightly trickier question to answer. We're going to look at the um, biopsychosocial model of uh, challenge and threat as well. Guess who? Real simple game. Now I've made a separate YouTube channel called Teacher Geeks and I'm using that channel to explain activities like this. So if you've never never done it before, you can, um, I'll link the videos in the unit plan and you can also subscribe to that channel. You can get some ideas for basic activities that can apply to any, um, any lesson, any age group. Cartoon strip. This might be challenging, but uh, I thought it was something different for students to try. Can they draw a cartoon of Lazarus and Faulkner's full definition. Now, as always, the idea here is not to produce a beautiful cartoon, but to get them engaging and thinking about the definition that of stress of Lazarus and Faulkner, the idea of it's um, when a personally relevant situation is taxing or exceeding resources um, and produces a physiological response. Okay, so we can do the uh, TRIA social test stress test. Now, the all the instructions here are in the, and the materials are in the activities file. I actually was lucky enough to get the original materials used uh, in the original study and so um, you can manipulate this by giving the students different information and then they do the TRIA social stress test. Um, I think there are some videos as well uh, on this if you don't want to um, if you don't do it in class but ideally if you can set it up to do the, the TSST I've allowed plenty of time in these lesson plans uh, for that because I know that it can take a little bit of time to do. But anyway, here is Jameson's studies and we're looking at how um, different reappraisals can influence the stress response and then how that might lead to other health problems down the line. Again, there is uh, video tutorials on all this as well. Okay, as well as all the information is in um, the book right here. Okay, uh, and then some space here for students to apply it. Okay, and then a second study which is really interesting about how they did this as a field experiment. Okay, uh, now in the back of the workbooks, I put it here, how to cope with stress. Uh, you know, really why I would want to teach this unit is so students can learn um, how, do they, how do they deal with stress and how can they to apply it for their real lives. So I, I put a space here in the back of the workbooks for students to do that. So just two lessons on appraisals. Uh, and the appraisal, the idea of appraisals, it really helps to understand the definition of stress uh, and it can provide a cognitive explanation. And again, there's another one with locus of control coming up later. But next we get into the social cultural explanations, which is mainly about social status.